So today I'm gonna answer the question, what clubs do I use? Oh yeah, what up you guys? Welcome back to another one of these videos. Now, if you're new to the channel, there's not gonna be any negative chicks. Sorry. <laughs> so this channel is all about juggling. Uh, if you like juggling, if you're into juggling, please subscribe, like the video, leave a comment. All of that good stuff is all appreciated, so stick around. So most of you guys know me from Instagram, and the biggest question, or the, at least the most common question that I get all the time, what clubs do you use? Like, do you recognize this? This is the one that I use now. Question that I get all the time is like, what clubs do you use? What clubs are those? And I'm gonna answer the question now. So what I'm using is Henry's Dolphins. So I'm gonna talk about Henry's Dolphins, okay? A lot of people mistake these clubs to be uh, PX4s, but these are not, these are Henry's Dolphins. And I use Henry's Dolphins, I love them, and I'm gonna tell you guys why. Now before I get started, I just wanna let you know, Henry's does not sponsor me. They never paid me anything to say anything. Uh, just to be fair though, they did give me a set of these clubs, 10 clubs of these, 10 of these for free. Now it wasn't free, I gave them a bunch of pictures, I gave them rights to use my pictures for their promotional material. So in a sense, yes, they gave me a set of clubs, but I also gave them, so it wasn't like a sponsorship, it was sort of like a business deal. So instead of them buying the pictures from me, I was like, you know, give me clubs, I give you pictures. And they're like, all right, let's do it. <laughs> so that is how I ended up getting this. But before this, first clubs, um, I started off with some random like one piece plastic clubs. And they were fine at the beginning, but you know, they were not. And they were also, they were bad ones. When I went to buy them, they only had three different, only three ones, I wanted five. So I had to buy, and they had two like pretty ones, but even lighter ones. So I had to buy three of one size and then two different clubs that were also one piece. And they were just super light, hard, plastic piece of shit. Okay, so those were my first clubs. And then my second clubs were like some, I think they were like Mr. Babar's Euro Flip color silver or something like that. And they were like okay, but very fast. They were quite heavy. They had a wrap handle. The wrap started to come off and the knob started to bend. Okay, so it's a very cheap screw inside them. Um, yeah, so after that, I got my first dolphins. And it was actually a bunch of people in the circus school, they ordered Henry's dolphins. And they were like, hey, do you want to order some dolphins? I think this was. 2000 or 2002 something like there early 2000s and I got my first dolphins which were pink now this is not the ones they asked me what color do you want and I was like hmm I know a lot of people who use them and orange was a huge color back then so I thought I like what color do you have and they did like this and this and I right, let's do the pink ones so the first one that I got was actually pink and I got five of them and I used them a lot, and then at some point I got two more, but they didn't have pink anymore, so I got orange. So I had five pinks and two oranges for seven clubs. Uh, yeah, and I've used these ever since. I have tried different clubs. I have tried, well, like Mr. Babash clubs, never really liked them. I did try play clubs, those PX3s, the light version that they came out. They were super bendy. Um, they were okay, but they were not good for multiplexes and body rolls and stuff that I do. 
I don't like the longer handle. I like the shorter handle, which is why I use Dolphins. And yeah, I tried also Pirates, which is like Henry's as well. Renegade clubs, I tried Renegade. Uh, so I tried a lot of different ones, and I, every time that I'm like in a juggling convention, I try different clubs. But still, I like the most these Henry's Dolphins. Um, so yeah, so I got the pink ones. This is a newer pink ones from Circus Circus. But I just wanted to show you. Then I got the white ones after that. I needed more. I didn't break them, but I just wanted different color than the pink ones. I wanted white ones for a specific show. So I got the white ones. And I used these for a very long time. And then I also wanted some pretty ones for stage. And that's when I made these. So I made five of these and I've used them for stage for like 10 years. Yeah, because I only use them on stage. So they don't really go bad. So yeah, I've had a set of five for like 10 years, I think, for stage. So yeah, they last a very long time. And now I got this. Now the reason why people think that this is a PX4 is because of the white middle ring. Now you can get this in different colors. You have the knobs. I think there's like maybe seven different colors or so. And you can get the top part in different colors. But this is the thing. And you can get this white or black. But they don't make colored handles, which is very stupid because they make color handles. Henry's makes color handles for loops, which is like dolphin in a period size. So it's a longer handle and a shorter top. But they don't make color handle for this, which is insane. Because this is the thing. If you didn't know, and most people don't know this, Henry's made colored uh, handles for Renegade. And I think someone else also have them. So they, there is colored handles for dolphins, and you can buy them from Renegade Chuckling, which is, I think it's just insane. Like, why do you make colored handles for other people to sell, but you don't sell them? It just doesn't make sense. Like, Henry's, if you're watching this, what the... Like, I don't know. So, <laughs> please sell the handles. But anyways, if you want dolphins with the colored handles, Renegade has them. And yeah, Renegade didn't pay me to say, I just heard that they have them and I saw them on the website. They have them. So yeah, I would actually love them, but... Okay, anyways, let's get back to the thing. A uh, few more things about the dolphins, and then I'm gonna explain you why I like them. Now, first of all, here is a few different things that you may or may not know. The handles changed uh, a few years ago. This is the new handle. This is the old handle. The difference is, it's not a big difference. So this is hard and shiny, right? And this is a little bit softer and it's matte color, okay? It's not a shiny, it's matte. And uh, that's the biggest dif difference. As far as I know, uh, Henry's wanted to make some softer ones. I don't know who, re like, who initiated this, but they sent to Hava Twitsten and Kristen Van Wyk. They sent a whole bunch of different uh, handles to try and test. They were like different softness, and they tested out and they said that this was the best one that they think, and now Henry's makes it in this. Now the first time that I got like they gave me the new set of clubs, it had the new handle. And I was like, what the hell is this? And I tried it, I didn't like it at all. It felt very slippery, it felt really bad, it felt too soft, what I'm used to. But it was, I, I, I couldn't get a grip, but it was actually on winter. Now in winter, especially here in Finland, it's super dry and cold. So my hand was really dry and cold, so I couldn't get that grip. So I thought it's because of the club. The club sucks. The club handle is bad. But it was actually my hand that sucked. My hand was bad. <laughs> so after that, uh, I noticed when I practiced more, I had a little bit of sweatiness in my hands. And I was like, oh man, now you can feel the grip. So I noticed that it's actually my hands, not the handle itself. So after playing with it a lot, I started using a lotion and stuff like that. So now I can get that good grip from right away when I use the lotion. Uh, and yeah, it is a specific type of lotion that I use. But anyways, yeah, so the new handle then, I did like it. Now I love this. I don't like this old one anymore, so I don't use the old ones anymore unless I have to. I really like this new one, the matte 
a better grip, better feeling to it, and the softness is just, mm, just good. All right, another thing that you did not know about these clubs is that the stick inside, it's not the original stick, okay? The original stick is heavier, is bigger. I use these sticks. The only difference with these is it's 56 grams. I think the normal stick is around 70 grams. So my club is actually about 12 or 14 grams lighter than normal. And that makes a huge difference. Now, it is possible you can just uh, ask, you can, you can make the sticks yourself. You just get a stick, weigh them, and ta-da, you have a lighter stick. But you can also ask Henry's to make it. The normal club, I think it's around 206 grams, 208 grams, something like this, okay? So it is quite light in a sense, but this is 194 grams. So it is much lighter. So it depends on this weight. It's about 12 to 14 grams lighter because of the stick. And that makes a huge difference because when you juggle all day long, just having that 10 to 14 grams, like this is 12 to 14 grams lighter, it's it's amazing difference. It is a huge, huge difference. Because think about it. Every time you throw, 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 so even if it's only like 10 grams difference, that's like 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. You'd have to juggle for like 10 seconds and you basically you juggle just one kilo lighter almost. Okay? So if you just count every throw, it adds up to a lot of weight. So it is much better for your hand, your wrist and everything. And to me, the tricks that I do require a lot of speed, especially I do a lot of multiplexes with five. So I really love that I can take the two, I go really quickly and easily, I can throw again because of the lightness. It just gives me so much more speed and also my muscles stay more relaxed. I can train longer and have less injury. So I really, really love how they handle. And also I love the part that is, it gives me a little bit more, you know, it makes it a little bit easier to be faster. And I really love that. Now on the contrary, the tapes, they add more weight. So what can I do with this? And this, now the difference is huge because the difference between this one and this one is the tape and it's 10 grams. It's about 10 grams the tape adds. So if I take this one and I add 14 grams, I get that. And then I add another 10 grams, I get this. So the difference between these are huge, but I only, I use these outside shows because they add a little bit more weight. So it's a little bit wind resistant. And also when I need to have a shiny clubs, I use these. But I know that I cannot do all the same stuff with these because it's also, it adds weight and also it puts the weight on the front. So it's not, exactly in the same place the center anymore. Now it's just a little bit more front heavy. So it's just something to think about. All right, but enough of that chit chat. Quickly about this, how do you get the lighter sticks? So you can ask them. The way that Henry's gets these sticks, they get a huge amount of sticks and they weigh them because wood is not always the same. It's wood, it's not man-made metal, it's nature-made wood, so, or plastic or whatever. So it's not always the same density. Sometimes it is much lighter. It's not a lot, but they wait. They take every, when they get a box, like sh ton of, I was gonna say shitloads, but <laughs> when they get a ton of these sticks, they weigh them all individually. They have them this size and then they wait. See the weight and then they put it here. And then they put the next one and they take the lighter ones aside. They're not gonna sell you those but they do keep them, they have them in the storage. So if you want lighter sticks, you can ask lighter sticks. But this is the warning though. Lighter sticks means the wood is not so dense, means it will break more easily, okay? So if you do want lighter stick, just know that it can break much more easily. But after I got this, I, do, I did break a few. I think I broke now four, maybe four clubs in two years, so it's not that a lot. And it's very easy to change because it comes with the holes and everything ready. But I just bought extra ones. 
So when I got more stuff from them, I bought more stuff, I bought secret boxes and everything. I was like, all right, and also can I have extra sticks and they weighed 56 grams. So if you want this exactly the same, you want to try this, this is 56 grams, all right? Five, six. Cool. So now let's talk about the club. Uh, <laughs> because this is the thing, before the PX4s, I think even before the PX3s, everybody said that dolphins are toys. They sound like plastic toys. This sound, that sounds like a plastic toy. And some people, they say that you know, it's very bad. But as soon as those PX clubs came, the PX3 and the PX4, nobody said anything about dolphins anymore. Because those clubs, they sound so plastic, toy, hollow. It's like boom, boom. It's like, listen, it's like boom, boom. So it's very, it's like this sound. That's like this snap kind of thing. But those are like boom, boom. They sound so much like bad toys. So it was so funny. Nobody talks about them sounding toys, but nobody talks about dolphins sounding like toys anymore either so that's very often very interesting but yeah so i don't think it's a problem anymore of that this doesn't sound like a toy especially if you compare it to the px clubs as a side note though i'm very very super curious about the new ex clubs with the aluminum stick yeah i did try them quickly but it was a different shape it was like a pure red shape with a longer handle I would love to try them on one of these sides. But anyways, let's talk about why I like this. So first of all, Henry's knobs, but obviously you can change the knobs. My biggest thing that I love about these dolphins is the wooden stick, right? Because the wooden stick, it doesn't bend, so it's very responsive. You get what you want from it. Like, it will stop when you need it to stop. When you do these hits, it will bam bam. It doesn't go like boom flexible like that. You don't get this whoa, whoa, whoa. You don't get any of that kind of reaction. With some clubs you do. It's sort of like the whoa, whoa, whoa. And when you throw, it goes, it's just because it's a wooden stick, it stays straight. It stays, it doesn't shake, it doesn't wobble, nothing like that. So yeah, that's what I love about the wood. And for me, I do a lot of those club hitting. I hit it with the other club, I hit it with the hand. And they're just very easy to control, very light to do, it doesn't hurt you. To me, it's just, it is just good, okay? And I think they they made this very well. The new handles are fantastic. This is a little bit soft, also the top, which gives you more bouncy when you hit them. And yeah, yeah the knobs are the best ones in the market. So I really love Henry's Dolphins and I've been using them a lot. Now, it doesn't mean that if a better clubs comes along, Will I change? Yes, of course. I'm trying all the time new clubs. But for now on, this works best for me what I do. And what I do mostly is five club stuff, five club multiplexes, and club hitting all the kind of body roll stuff. So that's why I like the short handle, the bigger top, and the new handle, the soft matte handle. It feels fantastic. And the responsiveness of the wood. It's just this bam, bam. You can really feel when you compare it to the other clubs, you can just, with this, it just, there's none of that. And yeah, it's very easy to repair. And yeah, obviously when you compare it to the other, like, when you compare it to the other clubs that don't break, that have like a carbon fiber or whatever inside, I don't know. I, I haven't broke this so many, like I've used this daily for over two years, I think this is not third, no. I got it in 2018? No, 17, 2017 I got this and I've used it since. And yeah, I think I broke four clubs. Four. <laughs> so I've used it pretty hardcore all the time. Uh, yeah, but obviously I clean them, I only use them on inside. I see a lot of people, they break this when they're outside, but all clubs destroy when you're outside. Inside. I've used it, I can use it for years and years and years if I just have new sticks. Anyways, cool. That is some of my thoughts about Henry's Dolphins.
yeah, I like them. I want to use them all the time. I think they're just mm, fantastic. But anyways, and you can get them in different colors, shapes or whatever. That is it. That's the clubs that I use, Henry's Dolphins. Thank you so much. And Henry's, if you see this, please send me more clubs. Please give me a sponsor deal. <laughs> anyway, that's all I had to say about that. Please subscribe. And if you do want to learn more about chuckling, I have my online chuckling masterclass, which is like at the time that I'm recording this video, there's over 400 tutorials in there. Tutorials, lessons, how to learn new tricks uh, about club technique, ball technique, ring technique, pirouettes, stretching, how to create your own tricks, your own uh, routines and everything. There's so much material. There's about how to teach, it's just, it's insane how much material. Over 400 tutorials. I think there's only like close to 70 hours of video. Okay, so there's a lot of stuff in there. It's probably the biggest selection of chocolate tutorials ever made. So definitely check that out if you're interested. I will put the link below. It's nine euros a month, so it's not a bad price. And you can try it out. If you don't like it, you get a full refund. So definitely worth trying. That is it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next lesson or video or whatever you call this. <laughs> see you there. Mm.